Hi everyone! In this video we are going to be talking about fact families. Our goal today is to understand the relationship between addition and subtraction using fact families. I'm going to start by showing you a picture of a domino and I want you to think about how many different numbers you can see on the domino. You may have only seen two numbers on the domino, but if you look again, I bet you can see that there are three numbers on the domino. Let me show you. The green dots on the left side show me the number two. The brown dots on the right side show the number four. If you count all the dots on the domino, you can also see the number six. Did you know that we can write four different number sentences just by looking at this one domino? Let's look. Let's remember the three numbers we saw on this domino were two, four, and six. We will only be using these three numbers to write all four of our number sentences. Our first number sentence can be two plus four equals six. I knew this by adding both sides of the domino together. Next, I knew that if two plus four equals six, then four plus two must also equal six because it's the turnaround fact. The six is highlighted in red because it is the biggest number. The biggest number always starts our subtraction facts. Look at this. I'm still using the same three numbers. If I start with six and take away two, my answer equals four. Six minus two equals four. And if I start with six again, but this time take away four, my answer equals two. Six minus four equals two. All four of these facts are related because they use the same three numbers. This is called a fact family. All fact families have addition facts using a plus sign and subtraction facts using a minus sign. A lot of fact families have two addition facts and two subtraction facts. But when the fact family has a pair of doubles, there's only one of each. Let's look at this domino. After looking at both sides and then counting all of the dots, we can see that the three numbers for this domino are two, two, and four. Let's see what would happen if we tried to write two addition facts and two subtraction facts to go along with this domino. My two addition facts are two plus two equals four and two plus two equals four. My two subtraction facts are four minus two equals two and four minus two equals two. Since I don't need to write the same thing twice, Let's get rid of those number sentences that I already have. Now I can see that when a fact family has a double or the same number twice, there will only be one addition fact and one subtraction fact. Thank you for watching. Keep practicing and stay healthy.